Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm here with my friend Marta. Hi guys. Um, we met, uh, I think, about four years ago during one of the VS shows in Paris. Paris, probably. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and today we're here, and I invited her to bring her bag and to show you guys what is in our bag. I'm actually really curious like what another model of duty brings. And before we get started, don't forget to follow Martha on Instagram, pop it up here and to follow me as well. And yeah, let's 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 dive let's on in. Start. To the Did you bring like your bag? your your favorite your <laughs> favorite bag all time? I'm dying because she has this adorable small bag. I'm like, how are you fitting things on the go in this bag? But I'm I can't wait to look see at it. I'm like, there. I don't know what. Yeah, I put a lot of stuff in there. Um, I really love this, this one. This is too. my little doctor bag that was a gift from Tom Brown, and I like it because it's that perfect travel size on the go kind of bag. Yeah. So there's definitely items in here that I always have when I travel. I'm very, I'm very curious. It's probably um, like our four-year anniversary because I feel like the Vita show was always around this time. Yeah, it was around this time. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> four years. Four years in. There she is. I love that. Oh, I can she see has why you would like travel here. with it. Yes. And this is like a petite travel. little baguette. I feel baguette bags are very like Hi. trendy now. Um, you know what it is? It doesn't matter for me how what, what size bag I take with. It's always full. If it's, if I go bigger, Same. it's still full. So Same. at this point, I'm like, I need to get a small bag, because otherwise I take too much. Like that's stuff actually with a really smart way to look at it because even though I just got a bigger apartment, it's still overflowing with stuff. Yeah, so no matter how much space you have, I will always jam it packed to the maximum capacity. Put it in there. Well, all right, let's open up. What is your first item? First item. I have my hairbrush. Hairbrush? Yes. I is that a Mason Pearson? Yeah. Honestly, Ooh, guys, those I, are the it, nice ones. it is it is a big, big investment, but like it's one of the best ones. The Maison the, the, the person? Yeah, you're probably saying it the best. No, I, I was saying the French way and I see Pearson? England and I'm like, what? This is the nicest hairbrush. Oh, she says Maison de Pe the Maison de Pearson. This is like the like the Lamborghini of hair I know, brushes. Yeah, I just have the really imitation brush. It doesn't like take out your hair and it just like makes it shiny. I always bring sunglasses. Yes. And I have a very small face, so most sunglasses because the trend is big. Yeah, I have a very small face. It doesn't oh, fit. Oh, then I should sit way back here because my These are like the only ones which actually like. Those are kind so of fits cute on me. I love so them. Just the Raymonds. Um, They're very Beatles. Pairs. Yeah. Like John Lennon ish yeah. vibe. All right, what's next? A Kindle, which needs to be charged. Because if you're not reading, do you? What are you doing? Do you, I, I question on like set, you know? Normally when we're like on set of photo shoots or productions, we have to wait a lot because you know, hair, makeup, whatever. Do you like, are you more like a person who's like chatting or like, are you reading or like, are you on your phone? Like what, what, do, you, what do you do? <laughs> I love that you asked that. That's such a very good model to model question. I feel like because I struggle with this, sometimes I would rather um, work or read, but I feel kind of a pressure to be part of the group yeah. and to chat. What do you, what about you? Yeah, I think I have the same thing actually. I can't even focus when a book because I heard all these things. Yeah. There's so much going on on this head. Um, it's true actually, I've struggled uh, with that. Yeah, it's hard now because like they kind of, you want to be like social and everything, but then they also expect to like, that you answer all the emails with coming like from management and stuff. That's true. So like, but then there's also like B-roll cameras usually on you and hair and makeup these days yeah. as well. So there's so many moving parts. It's kind of impossible yeah. to get lost in a book. On for travel, so, I bet. It's, but for it's, travel, it's, it's pretty it's, good. It's, um, this was actually a gift from a fan in China. <laughs> Aww. And it kind of stays in my bag when I travel. It does look a lot like my dog bear. This looks so cute. So it's fun to travel with. Does it bring luck? I definitely think it brings good yeah. luck. Good. I recently started carrying around this uh, facial oil. And this is a brightening facial oil from the brand Easy. And I'm a co founder of this skincare brand. And okay. it is not out there yet. The facial oils are finally, we've been like testing it out and everything. 
and probably early next year it will be available. So I kind of, so and what I really love, it has CBD in there, so it kind of has this like healing, it has a healing factor on the skin, what, that's what CBD does. Yeah. And it only uh, contains like natural oils, like strawberry oil, um, like right, so we can try a little bit. Oh and my you God, can this use this so for like, good. this one is a brightening one, ah. so you can use this on your face. Because you know like how many products, they always put so many products on our face during photo shoots yes. and everything. And there's so many skincare products out there and your skin doesn't need that much. It just yeah. needs like a good wash and then maybe a nice oil or moisturizer. And besides that, I'm not saying you should not use like, anything yeah. else, but in general, like your skin has its own yeah. Yeah. I do tend to stick to less is more when it comes to exactly. skincare. <clears throat> but what I love about CBD is that it is anti-inflammatory and oils are great because they also remove makeup. So they're really gentle on your skin and they're hydrating, yeah. so they're really good to travel. And with there's as well. just literally natural ingredients. There's no like chemicals in it there. Smells so good. Um, you can even uh, use this on like an oily skin. People with an oily skin sometimes think you can't use oils, mm. uh, but it actually helps because your skin is like, oh, it has enough oil now. And yeah, it exactly. Stops making it. Yeah. That's a big misconception. It smells, really good. It smells mm. so good. I love it. Oh, look at you. <laughs> What's this one? This one is a CBD. I normally like to have the CBD gummies. Yeah. Because they're just so easy and you don't really taste it. This is like a CBD oil from Green Roads. And you just put this in like, it's kind of this like sticky consistency. Um, and it doesn't I taste... I love CBD. Do you use it in mint or how do you use I it? I have um, an ointment that I use at home. I should have brought it. It's called the Wildflower Stick. And I put it on my back at night and it really relaxes my oh, muscles the balm and soothes is my body. Yeah. This is a YSL lip. I'm just really into coral Are right you wearing now. this? The lip color that I'm wearing now is this brand called Medina, which is a makeup artist's favorite. It's this Milan-based makeup brand that's actually been discontinued. However, I do have similar versions of the coral. This is a clay de peau lip. Like Ooh, illuminizer. Very, this bright color it's looks like so good. Corally color. Thank you. Lately, you put this just... on top, didn't you? Yeah, 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 yeah. So I've been wearing this. And also this YSL color that I've been into lately. This one has a bit more red in it. Are you more like lipstick or lip gloss fan? Both. I like both, but if I put on lipstick, I like to put on a lip mask underneath. A lip mask? Yeah. Which one are you using? I'm using this Laneige. Oh my god, that's my you like favorite that one? one. Oh my god. I'm yes. out of it because I left it somewhere, I think. But like that's my to-go. I yeah. how did I just learn about this? I know. It <laughs> seems like so many people knew about it yes. and I just discovered it. it's the best thing ever. Um so yeah, corally reds and oranges nice. are my vibe right now. I'm lately kind of into like the new bash ones. Mm -hmm. It's actually one from like Colourpop, so it's really, really, really affordable. Um, it's Gimme S'more, and it's a mixture between like a lip stick and lip gloss. It's an in-between. Oh, I like it. I like the texture. Yeah, so it's, it's not nice so heavy, texture. and yeah, this is it. <laughs> Sorry, I just gotta get it all like, <laughs> but it's such a nice color. I like lip colors that aren't too pink actually. There's like a perfect, there is the perfect amount of brown in it. Yeah, so I like that. It goes more beigey. Holidays are coming up. So. <laughs> Never Always know beige. when this could come in handy. <laughs> Little Jack and Coke. Um, I sometimes do that in a plane. I take the little wine bottle yeah. because I'm like, this is cute. I love everything in Mini. <laughs> take a little nap afterwards. Lanoli. <laughs> I find it very hard to find good lips because they're all just like they dehydrate, I feel, instead yeah, of actually hydrate. Yeah, they're almost like slippery yeah. sometimes. And this is very thick and it actually works like really, really nice. So I'm curious what else is in your... Oh, room. wow. I mean, we're getting there. We're getting to the bottom of my Mary Poppins bag. <laughs> Sunglasses. So we were thinking the same. Oh, you are wearing Ravens too. Oh, classic. <laughs> Unstoppable. 
I really try not to drink out of plastic water bottles. Yeah. So, if you would like a sip and just you're, stay you're welcome to hydrate it. Gotta stay hydrated. That's a good one. It's a big one. Actually, I did not put it in my bag now, but I have this like little plastic thing where you can like have a foldable like uh, metal straw, which is like yeah. Nice. Because on no set, way. it's I feel like it's getting a lot better now being on set. But you, in the past, I would see how many plastic water bottles or straws would get wasted, it, and it makes me feel so guilty just so being part of that production. So I try to always bring my yeah, own water they bottle. Yeah, like put it down and then like you take two zips and then like something happens. Then you're rushed off to set and, and no one knows yeah. whose water bottle it is. Really bad. It's really bad. bad. Um, a speaker. You bring a speaker. <laughs> I do. When I, I travel, that. I have I to have music that. with me. I do have my headphones because I love the noise cancelling ones. Yeah, now. those are really good for the plane yeah. too. But I have AirPods, but I'm missing one, so this just makes just more sense. Bring the speaker. <laughs> but when you're getting ready in a hotel room while traveling, it's it's really Actually, good to have that makes a speaker. Sense. That makes sense. I'm speeding mine up. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Disposable camera because I just Ooh. think they're really fun. I love that. For some reason, I love the pictures from like a disposable camera so Me much too. better than like anything else. Yeah. Perfect. Um, and these are two photos that I always keep in my wallet. One is uh, me and my boyfriend and my dog bear. Aww. Because I'm old fashioned and I like to travel photos. This is so cute. <laughs> I do always bring uh, scrunchies. Ah, me too. Scrunchies. I feel it like when, because you, I don't know, I'm like very thin and like fine hair so when I put elastics it makes this like really weird like bend and more yeah. and the scrunchies it also like I yeah, agree. a little yeah. less it doesn't damage and it looks a little bit more cute scrunchie club 20 um actually a manicurist just gave these to me these are collagen gloves so you uh -huh. wear them over your hands and they cut off right at the nail while you're getting your nails so you done, can... you'll get a little collagen boost for your hands. Wait, so when you're getting your nails done, you can like just wear, put these on? Yeah. Do you want to try them on? Yes. We can use I noticed that a lot with like flying that my hands get so so dry. Really dry right? right? This now. is perfect. And I have foot ones too. And I, what I'll do also when I'm flying, I'll put them on and then put a sock on top of it so that it forces it to stay. Really? Yeah. Does so it make my it mess feet stay it moisturized during flights. All right, let's figure this out here. Because I have these like gloves where you put the cream on and you kind of like sleep overnight. Uh, but I've never tried the ones which you actually... Oh, they're not that sticky actually. Okay, so it's kind of like wet from the inside. So you can yeah. feel that. But look, you can just take the tops off. So even for people who are like impatient, yeah, exactly. and they want to be on their phone, you have like a hand glow. Fun. Okay. okay. I have nothing left in this bag because like nothing fits in here. Um, we did it. That was my was, last one. That was your last one. Yeah. That was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy watching this video as much as I did. Thank you. Martha for coming by today. Um, Thank you for having me. Yeah, don't forget to follow Martha on Instagram, check out her YouTube. You will find the link in the description down below. And also, um, yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys very soon. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.